Did you know? There is a lake in Tanzania that can turn animals to stone. And I'm not talking about a magical petrified forest here. It is called Lake Natron, and it has water so salty that it kills anything that falls in it. The reason why it's so salty is because it's a soda lake, meaning that it has a high concentration of sodium carbonate, which makes the pH of the water extremely alkaline. In fact, the pH of the water is between 9 and 10, which is highly alkaline. For comparison, the pH of seawater is around 8 and the pH of blood is around 7.4. So you can imagine how alkaline Lake Natron is. I'm talking about a lake that's so salty it actually preserves creatures that fall in it. When an animal falls into the lake, the salt essentially cooks its body, dehydrating it and removing all the water from its body. This process is called basic hydrolysis of estrogen. The animal's body is then turned into a solid mass of soap and salt. This process is similar to what happens when you make soap at home, except that in this case, the animal's body is the fat and the salt is the lye. And these creatures are often preserved in such lifelike detail that it is like they re-literally turn to stone. These salts and minerals form a crust on the surface of the body, which protects it from being washed away by the wind or water. Over time, this crust can become rock hard, preserving the creature in stone. So keep watching to find out what this magical lake is and how it turns animals to stone. I've found everything from fish to birds to mammals, including a very rare mammal called a bush baby. These creatures are often preserved in such lifelike detail that it's like they're frozen in time. You can see their muscles, their bones, and even their eyes. It's like they're just taking a nap and will wake up any minute now. In the heart of East Africa lies a lake that's not just salty, but super salty. This extreme alkalinity is what makes Lake Natron so deadly to most living things. The reason why Lake Natron is able to preserve these creatures in such great detail is because of the high concentration of salts and minerals in the water. One of the most amazing things about Lake Natron is the variety of creatures that it has preserved. If you ever find yourself in Tanzania, I highly recommend checking out Lake Natron. It's truly a one-of-a-kind experience. Hey there, if you're enjoying the content and want to see more, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. It's free and it really helps the channel grow. Plus, you'll never miss out on new uploads. Thanks for the support.